Ankit, Ankit says, can we expect a STEM drop before the end of this year and at what score? Um, also, can I add my spouse if the cutoff is less than our combined score? Okay, so let's just take one part of this question separately and the other one separately. Uh, can we expect a STEM draw by end of this year? I hope so, yes. Uh, although IRCC has and the PNPs have shown no interest in STEM categories. In fact, all the PNPs, including BC, Alberta, Ontario, they have clearly said that we don't have any labor priority of market or, um, you know, uh, invitation left for STEM category. Uh, but sh the good part is that IRCC has still not removed STEM from its preference categories. It is still a part of those categories. Can we expect a draw? I hope we at least get one draw. Uh, because then it will be a bit unfair for these categories because if we see no invitation in any of those draws, that's going to be you know, very unlikely. What is the cutoff? I believe the cutoff will be very high because there are a lot of IT people sitting in the pool. I think a STEM category draw, depending upon the size they hold, somewhere between 500 to 510, that should be the kind of a draw uh, that we should be looking at STEM. Now, can I uh, add my spouse? The second part of your question, can I add my spouse if the cutoff is less than uh, our combined score? Of course, why not? Uh, if, if say, you get invited at, say, for example, 510, okay, and you're already sitting at 530, then if you add your spouse, by adding your spouse, your score drops to 520, you are still above the cutoff, which was 510, then fine, you can do the file. But if adding your spouse drops your score to below the cutoff, then you will have to reject that particular round of invitation. I hope that clarifies.